it's Tom from the UK Peppers Radio Network. Down at the Bug Out weekend, having a fantastic time with some really, really cool people. Some rather famous, a lot more famous on YouTube than, than I am. I'd like to introduce my knife. I've designed it myself. It's made by Dave Tilling in Wales at the Welsh Knife and Crafts. And this is what I call the Titan. It's a rather large knife, I think you'll agree. And it's got an 8mm spine. It's absolutely solid, 01 tempered and hardened steel. It comes with a micarta or a wood handle, a kydex or a leather sheath. And I would like to show you how this works. It's a knife for life. It will never ever let you down. In fact, if it does, we'll give you a new one free wherever you live in the world. And I've got somebody rather better known on Facebook than me, in fact, better known on YouTube. And he's called Rich. And Rich is going to help me in a moment to show what this knife can do. Because I, at the moment, am not fit enough to bend down and to do that myself. So we'll be handing over to Rich in a minute. Hello, I'm uh, Rich from Torn Apart Self Sufficiency. Just having a, a play with a different blade here. Uh, very, very nice weighted, heavy piece of kit. Got a nice spine on it, so you can use that with a fire steel or anything. It's, it's just big in your hand, it's nice. Um, yeah, you can really get tight up there and get in the trail and uh, can do some tighter work with it. And it's, I mean, that is sharp. <laughs> that is really sharp. For something that big, you wouldn't expect it to be just biting like that. You can actually shave with it, Rich. I mean, you can take shaving. hairs off your own. <laughs> you sound like my wife. Yeah. <laughs> no, she, she holds it. No, that's, that's lovely. Get right tight in there. Let's uh, see if they can get right in on that. You can even get all the delicate little feathers. If you can get feathers with something this size, you're laughing. Right, shall we give it some uh, a good workout now? Yes, that'll be a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> Straight through. Yeah. I do like that glow in the dark thing you've got. <laughs> Just in case you lose it when you're at night. Yeah, it's got a really good weight to it. Really good. Right, we'll see what it's like processing. That's well seasoned wood as well, isn't it? Oh yeah, this has been down quite a while. That's, that's tough wood, that. I know people are going to say, oh, mind your legs, but I have done this before. <laughs> down on it. Yeah, very nice. Yeah, for, for other tasks, I mean digging and things, it's, it is a big, big blade. I mean that. Be good for wood forward. Oh, I mean, if you were trying to prise something out, you, you, you'd easily open the door with that. Mm. You jam that into a door, that is, that is open. Mm. You know, and it's, it, it, it's big enough that you've got something to work with. So, no, instead of having a machete and a knife, that's that's like the kind of one-stop thing. To, so, I'd, I'd, I'd look around for more stuff to challenge it, but it, it, 
<laughs> it's, it's, it doesn't need it, it's, it will work. Yeah, the, only, the only real things that I would, if it was my personal knife, is it's absolutely fantastic when you're doing your tight work and, you, and you're right up in there. But when you're really, really battening, because of the size, the sheer size of it, I haven't got that smaller hands. But to get the, the balancing right, it is perfectly weighted. It, it is 50-50, kind of, it doesn't want to come out. But as you really go in for it, there is a few little hot spots where it is still fairly square. If they were just, just taken in ever so slightly, just for a couple of these edges, you could work and work and work with that. Um, other than that, can't fault it at I'll all. I'll check that on board, Rich. Are you saying then at the hand grip as well? It's yes. Like more, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, it, it, it's just, just to give it that little bit, I mean, as much as you've got the, the bits for your fingers in there, it, it is, you know, it is still quite square. So, yes. I mean, even, even just a little bit of work, if it was my own personal one, I'd just sit there with a bit of sandpaper and just work those in to my own, yeah. to my own hand. But then again, it's going to be a personal tool, so if anyone's going to buy that, it's more than likely going to be switched on enough just to modify it for themselves. Exactly. So, yeah, that's, other than that, that's, that's the only fault that I can have with it, is to my personal hand, I would adjust it slightly. Um, like I say, maybe a little bit sharper on the spine there for the ferro rod, mm -hmm. but, yeah, yeah brilliant. So overall then, um, overall, small modif modification? Very, very small modification. Um, it's, it is a big, heavy blade, but as a survival knife, it will do more jobs for being that big. You're not yeah. needing the big machete. You're not needing the fiddly little knife. I mean, compared to like my little bush knife, there's, there's you know, that is a big, <laughs> big knife, and that's, that's, I think that's six mil that one. So it's, it is a meaty. Well, I always say that a small knife cannot do what the big knife can do. No. The big knife can do what a small knife can do. Yeah, yeah, well, that, that's proved it. Just getting right in on there, still making feathers and things with, with something that size, it works. Yeah. So I can't fault it. Brilliant. Cracking bubble as well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, YouTube. Very, very grateful to to Rich. Thank you, Rich, for doing no, the time. Uh, doing the work, sir. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for your comments. YouTube. This is the Titan. Will be available for sale in the next week or two, we think. Uh, taking on board a lot of what Rich has said. Uh, some modifications to be made to the knife. Apart from that, I'm pleased with it. I know you're pleased with it. Yeah, it's a nice, nice tool. It does the job. That's what you can really ask of a knife to do. It'll save your life. It's not going to break. It's there for life. Yet it's heavy, but that's built into the design. So all I can say is watch this space.